Seven-year-old Trip Johnson was killed in a car crash in Hartford County. Nearly three years later, he's being honored in a very special way. WMAR 2 News' Ray Strickland shows us how the county is helping keeping his name alive. Ray? Seven-year-old Trip Johnson played football right up the road here, and now this same road has been named after him. An incredible honor for an incredible young man whose legacy will live on in Hartford County. Trip was a very special little boy who touched so many people's lives. Selfless and kind. That's how Debbie Johnson describes her grandson, seven year old Trip Johnson. Everybody loved him. Anyone he came in contact with, he he just beamed. He had aura around him. Trip was a second grader at William Packer O Post Elementary. Crystal O'Leary was his teacher. He loved people, he loved football, and he loved his family. Trip was killed nearly three years ago in Hartford County when a tractor trailer crashed into more than 10 cars at the intersection of Route 24 and Ring Factory Road. The crash also claimed the life of local ShopRite President Andrew Klein. The driver of the tractor trailer involved in the crash was acquitted on all charges earlier this year. We miss him. I relive that every day of my life. To honor Tripp's life and legacy, Hartford County named a road after him in Copenhaver Park. Tripp played football for the Joppa Town Seahawks nearby. His family called it a special moment. I could be more proud. I could be more proud. Rich Bennett is the president of the Joppa Town Lions Club. The organization asked the county to name the road after Tripp. People pull in here off the road and they're coming up the Trip, jo uh, Trip Johnson way to the football field, and I'm hoping these kids play football the Trip Johnson way, being kind, and he was kind. So if people can do that, I've, I'm looking at that as being the Trip Johnson way. Trip Johnson died when he was only seven years old, but it was the way he lived that will always be remembered. He was the type of person that a lot of us adults could learn to be. And this wasn't the first time Tripp was honored here in Hartford County. His school created a memorial for him, and his football team also retired his jersey. Reporting in Hartford County, Ray Strickland, WMAR 2 News.